Hello everybody, Spotikus here and welcome back to Tales of the Borderlands. So, episode 3 released today. I didn't pay attention and out of nothing the game started downloading and I was like, oh, oh episode 3 is here, so let's play it. So last time we ended with the Gordas Project and this really weird woman who I think is the uh, ex-wife from that father dude who is, is, was killed in episode 1 so yeah let's do this back so soon what's the rush okay okay sit down shut up and pay attention the misfit vault hunters had discovered the secret location of the Gortis project but getting there wouldn't be easy Hyperion had not forgotten about their renegade employees. And the native Pandoran wildlife was... Uh, just getting to know them. They escaped with their lives, but not much else. Out in the wasteland, the former middle manager discovered Handsome Jack riding shotgun in his brain while having a shotgun pointed at his head. Fancy meeting you a precarious position, to be sure. But nothing compared to the con artist. The price on her head had attracted all kinds of thugs and gunmen. Even a legendary vault hunter had joined the pursuit. You'd think that would have been the end of her story. But it turns out that even legends struggle with the demands of a personal life. Not as much as I miss Back Jamie. on the trail of the Gortis project, they found a wondrous hidden city. Risen from the corpse of a ghost town. But, unfortunately, their moment of awe and victory was to be the advantage of their opponents. <laughs> Taken hostage and forced to surrender the keys to the kingdom, they had to go all in on one last gamble. This chapter of the story begins with the questionable choice to trust the Pandoran Hustler. Yep. I trusted the lady. Oh yeah, this is the... like the time now. That must have been a tough decision. What, he's supposed to trust the psychopath? At least the psychopath had a plan. That's fair. Why did you choose Fiona? Especially when you consider your obsession with Jack. <laughs> he still doesn't think of it as an obsession. Well, I trusted her. I mean, what can I say? She never gave me a reason not to. Thanks. Hmm. That's interesting. They were a team. It was an easy call. I mean, when, when it gets tough, you stick with your team in a situation like that. It was the only choice. Obviously, it wasn't. Look, someone had to take the initiative. It wasn't like there were a lot of options. I don't suppose there's a spare for the spare. Well, if there is, I'm not changing it this time. We're close. We can walk it from here. Where the hell is here? Yeah. And why is it where we are? I'll tell you when I find what we're looking for. Okay. So, what happened next? <laughs> well, things started out fine. Oh, okay, so this was your plan. Just give me a light so I can see what I'm doing. Fine, here. Let's move. Well, where are we? Where are we even going? Because we are not helping them right now. No idea. Oh, good. We have to get back there. Vaughn and Sasha- I know. Um, Fiona? Yeah. What the hell? Oh 
shit. <sighs> Sorry, Gary. What's going <coughs> Shut up! On! You find anything yet? Nah. Gary's dead. Who? Gary. Oh, right. Just find them and we can put an end to all this. Huh? Already ended for Gary. Poor Gary. Stay here. Yeah, I'll stay here and look after the ball. <sighs> Hey, just come out, all right? Honestly, I, I will probably hurt you. So how quickly you come out will probably have to do with how much I hurt you. So if you come out quick, then dandy. Just getting that out there. Ah! Hey, got the fuck down. You stupid woman. You let Gary die. Revenge for Gary. Revenge. Yep, I did that once. You want to get in there real good and tight? <clears throat> yeah, heard that didn't go so great. What? You should. Um. Was, hey, over there or something. <laughs> uh, Reese. You're fun. Oh. Damn it, Reese! Keep your head down! Do you think I'm sticking my head up again after that? No, I'll tell you when to go, okay? I got it. You, I, I go when you say so. My third spot, move. Make your move. Oh, No, 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 no. Oh, shit. That was close. Okay. No, 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 no. Okay. No, 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 no. No. Go! Go. Ah! Oh, oh, hands off! Oh, shit. <laughs> Lobby from back here. No, we need Gordas first. You didn't get it? Focus, Reese. We need Gordas back or this whole thing's shot. But how? Got it all planned out. You throw your hat at exactly the right time so that the turrets shoot each other and blow up. We don't have much time. Who knows how long Vasquez will keep mm. Sasha and Vaughn around. But I like my hat. Now oh, you can buy a new one. They'll be rich. Fair point. Yeah. I don't know. I'm happy! <laughs> Touch goal. Touch goal? Shut up. Take this. I'll give you a boost. <laughs> you are so heavy. <laughs> it's the arm. Why don't you shoot the ice cream? I hate you so much. How are you so weak? Come on! 
Maybe if you'd help me. Oh. Sorry, sorry. What could have been becomes what is. Oh. Who's the wallet head now? <laughs> bitch. I hate the Yeah. What this? Yeah, baby. Good job. Nice. <sighs> I'm not trying to be all braggy, but I was awesome back. What the crap? Fun! Come on, buddy, talk to me. Crap. Loaderbot, would you mind? You can't move. You can't move. Twice if you're still breathing. Oh, come on, he's fine. Right, Fun? <laughs> See? He's having a blast. Okay, well, hopefully we can still get him out of here. Hey, I'm open to suggestions here, guys. Do you have an extra gun? No, you There! Loderbot, get pushing on that statue. Sash, let's go. That ass. All I can do is. Come on, hurry up! Trying. Please wait. Okay. Don't mention it. <sighs> you the leader of this outfit? Hey, you all right there, buddy? That's right. What of it? Cheeky. There she is. You remember me? Great. These jackasses. Oh, she remembers, all right. Oh, yeah. You look, uh, different. I look different, because you made me look different. <laughs> yeah, man, she knows. She's messing with all you, right, dude. that's enough. <laughs> Calm down, Finch. She's the one who melted my face. Oh, yeah, she did. Please, just, just let me shoot that girl in the in face. Get back in the truck. Just You're being a nuisance. Me too. Man, I didn't even... So what is Man, it that you want, exactly? Why you get me in trouble? Fee? 
Mm. I see why you're Felix's favorite. Don't be surprised. I've known about you two for as long as you've been lifting watches. But I'm out ten million bucks because someone turned a simple deal into a complete shit show. Someone has to pay for that. <laughs> <sighs> Looks like we have a couple new contestants. This isn't good. Okay, okay, I know how it looks. Things got a little messed up, but... Shut up! I... I'll deal with you later. I just want to say I had nothing to do with this. Uh -huh. Who's to blame here, Fiona? I want a name. Calm down, Hugo. No, no. Uh... I just... I just need her to know. She's gonna say it, it was my fault, and it's Give not... Give me a name. And you... Vasquez. He's the one to blame here. Did she say me? Really? And none of this would have happened if he hadn't screwed up the deal. Oh, she's lying. She is lying, Valerie. Please, you have got to believe me. It is not my fault. Look, I know you're super pissed, but we've got the Gordy's thing, and it is going to get us a vault that is worth way more than 10 million bucks, just like we told you. Everything is fine. We're fine. So this is what all the fuss is about. Yeah. Yeah. That's our little moneymaker. Huh? Then I guess I don't need you anymore. What? No! Oh! 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 I suppose I don't need any of you. Put her out of the deal, make her an head spin. Oh shit. Heads up. What? I thought it was a flash. <laughs> no, no. Uh, it is. That's not how it works. <laughs> And that's not how it went. <laughs> she put that gun in your face, and you would all... Keep talking. The truth this time. Fine. But... Where was I? <laughs> you were in the middle of this. I was getting Gordas back. Not here. We gotta go. This isn't over. You're the one leaving. Looks over to me. No. It'll feel much different than this. I let you know when it happens. Tell me, are you all... Just completely stupid. Uh. I mean, not completely. I mean, at least not all of us. I am here to help you, you idiots. Why did you take us? Oh. This is easily the most annoying contract I've ever taken. Oh, at least if it was an assassination, I'd have the pleasure of a kill at the end of it. Oh, well, I'm so sorry for the inconvenience. Who even hired you? A man named Felix. I normally don't divulge that kind of information, but he wanted you to know. He said to tell you he's sorry. What did he hire you for, exactly? Felix wanted me to pass along some knowledge, to mentor you, to help you survive. 
He felt you two had some untapped potential. You couldn't have told us this earlier? It's not exactly something you scream down an alley when you've got Valerie's goons.